Hippity hobbity, women are property. Welcome back to another video, guys. I stole that intro from Crazy Rabbit. You know what, actually? I'm gonna restart that because I am not sexist. What's up, Moist Boys? It's your boy Tim here. Welcome back to another Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Zombies video in the year 2019. Uh, <laughs> today we're gonna be upgrading every single gun in Black Ops 2 Zombies. Theoretically, not literally. The challenge states that we upgrade every single gun on town. Which is a perfect map to do it on because it's simple and it's not quite transit. Pack-a-punch is very easily accessible. Y'all wanted me to do this on transit, and I thought that would have been funny. But my god, it probably would have taken several attempts, and it probably would have driven me to insanity. So I chose not to do it on transit, but town instead. So it's the next best thing. Town's actually better than transit anyways. Uh, but yeah, there are 27 weapons total we have to pack-a-punch. And I gotta keep this starting pistol, because if I trade it out, I cannot re-obtain it so we have to keep this and 27 weapons total is going to cost 135,000 points which is quite a few points we have to rack up usually i go for galvan knuckles on this map but we will not be doing that for this specific challenge because guns 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 galore is what we need baby i've done this challenge on black ops 1 and black ops 3 both on kino der toten and shadows of evil I really noticed that I've been doing these on launch maps and not DLC maps, but I don't think that'll be the case for all of them, because when we do the World of War edition of this challenge, we will most definitely be doing it on Duris, since that's the only map on that game with a pack-a-punch machine. So, that won't be a reoccurring theme for much longer, but we find ourselves on this beautiful day, under this beautiful sky. Perk setup, it's gonna be interesting. I can't do the six perk glitch on solo. So, we're probably going to end up running Double Tap, Quick Revive, Jug, and Speed Cola, honestly, because, you know, Stamina Up is my preference, but we're not going to be doing a whole lot of running. This isn't a genuine high round, this is just me racking up a bunch of points and trying to upgrade every single gun in the game. So I'm actually really excited for the Black Ops 2 Edition, and uh, if you are too, make sure to leave a like. Or else. So for this challenge, I always go for the wall guns first because they're right there and they're cheaper and they're usually very efficient point weapons. There are only three, possibly two wall weapons on this entire map. Wall guns, that is. One of them is this M14, so I'll take that and I'll upgrade these two first. It's a little boring, I understand, but we gotta get them done at some point and I'd rather get them done now. The other wall guns of this map are the Olympia, which I think think is like right there and i think the mp5 is up there with jug hope you guys are having a fantastic week it's actually the weekend now if i manage to upload this when i want to on friday i'm very excited for the weekend and i hope you guys are killing those exams because i'm not gonna lie struggling a little bit with some of them but uh I I'm, I'm limping to the finish line here so i i hope you guys are doing just the same i don't hope you're limping to the finish line like i am but i hope you're passing them and i hope you're studying study motherfuckers double points an essential component for this challenge yes yeah, so i've been playing a ton of custom zombies on my channel recently and i understand not everyone's a fan of the custom videos i mean most people are especially the ones with the rabbit but you know i want to mix it up every now and then my content has usually been sort of like these types of videos and custom zombies is great but i understand they can get a little bit stale so it's good to sort of refresh things every now and then and a lot of you are also wondering where that reverse rainbow perk challenge is. Uh, it's coming. Uh, but this I thought I would do today instead. Welcome to the party, boys. All right, we got a ton of them. And we're going to upgrade this to the amnesia momentarily. And sorry if I sound all depressed and uh, monotone right now. It's simply because I just woke up. It's like 9.30 in the morning. And I usually do not record videos this early. But I, I got up. I showered. I walked my dog. I didn't walk my dog, actually. My dog walked me. No, I went on a sprint with my dog. We both sprinted up and down the street several times, and we were both, like, winded. We are winded after that one. So anyways, we got 1 out of 27 done. That's great news. So we got the upgraded M14, which is actually going to be very helpful for these earlier rounds. You know what? I'm actually curious to see if this MP5 is even up here on town. It's not on transit. On town, it is. Okay, so there are three wall weapons, so... We'll upgrade the M1911 right here, and then we'll get to this, and then the Olympia, and uh, before we do all that, we're probably going to grab Jug. You know what I just realized? I realized that I may have the zombies on easy difficulty, because when I was testing for audio, I put them on easy so they wouldn't overrun me and kill me while I was testing. Oh my god, they're on easy. Yep. 
Okay, well, uh, I have two options now. I can either restart or continue on easy mode and get shit on in the comment section. I think I'm just gonna roll the dice and keep going. I've done this challenge twice on normal, on other maps, which are actually harder, so... Y'all can just take my word. Y'all can just believe that I'm good enough to complete this on regular difficulty. I'll grab that, and I will also grab... Jug, that's a good thing to have. So again, the objective of this series is to upgrade every single gun in Zombies history, but not literally because there are some map-exclusive weapons out there, and I'm only doing one map per game, so there's actually going to be a handful of them that we won't upgrade, but you get the idea of this series. Uh, I think it's a pretty cool concept. Like, we're not going to get to to some of the other weapons, Wonder Weapons especially, on other maps. Uh, I know the M27 is exclusive on Nuketown. We're not playing Nuketown. That's just an example. But we got the vast majority of them. We got the base weapons. That's really the most important part of this challenge. So I lost my Xbox controller adapter, which means that I can't hear people or the game. So I have no audio, which is awesome. Uh, really cool addition to this challenge. <laughs> you know what? That makes, up for, uh, that makes up for this being uneasy instead of normal difficulty. How about that? The fact that I have no audio makes up for that. That's what I'm going to tell myself so I can sleep at night. Alright, we have enough to upgrade this. We'll get the Mustang and Sally pretty shortly here. I just want to see if I can... Hey, you going to fucking die? There we go. Okay. Alright. Hi, miss. Hi, ma'am. Oh, insta-kill. Perfect. See, we don't need a Galby Knuckles after all. Oh, good God. Okay, that was a nuke. All right, so we're going to go upgrade this, and that brings us up to 2 out of 27. I'm really not going to be using these very long because they are going to kill me. These things will be the death of me. I'll sort of display every weapon if I can, but I'm not going to just actively use the Mustang and Sally because there's no PhD flopper. I was contemplating town or nuke town for this challenge. I did not want to do something big like Origins or Mob of the Dead that would take hours. And I didn't want to do Transit or Die Rise because those maps are cancerous. And I can't do Bus Depot or Farm since there isn't even a Pack-A-Punch machine on those maps. So that really left us with this, Nuketown, and I suppose Buried, but... Oh, God, that, that would have taken a little bit longer, too. I'm just lazy, and I don't want to edit four hours of footage. I like this camping spot better. I mean, both of them work, but this one, I feel, is it's a lot more personal. It's a lot more close to home. Again, damage isn't really what's important for this challenge. Points are everything. Points is the key so we're gonna go grab the mp5 which is the last wall gun oh the olympia as well okay so we're gonna grab both of those that mp5 and smgs in particular are really helpful for this challenge for racking up points you want to get those early you want to get all machine guns early and then you want to end on the launchers and all the other shitty weapons all right so let's do it right now while the round is changing why not so we're gonna grab the olympia which is right around her love you mustang and sally but you are gonna kill me if i don't kill myself first so i'll grab that there we go. And actually, I'm going to try to run out of ammo with this M14. I don't think I will be able to, but I want to try to maximize its potential. I think I'm going to be camping for the most part, so I think I'm going to pass and stamina it up and go grab a uh, double tap and speed coil, and I'll just have the original four. You can't go wrong with the original four. All right, MP5, let's get it. Grab that off the wall, and that, that concludes all the wall weapons, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> all three of them. Town is just, just filled with wall weapons. All right, so the MP5, I believe, becomes the MP... Uh, 115 Collider. Yep, they kept that name from Black Ops 1. That's good. Oh boy! Oh boy! He scared me! Oh god. I miss you, Galvies. Even though you wouldn't be effective in round 15 anyways. I would have grabbed you. I totally would have grabbed you. Well, we clearly have enough to upgrade the Olympia, and that will bring us to the Hades if it's anything like Black Ops 1. And this is actually a pretty good power weapon, but again, we're not going for power, so we're probably not going to keep it for very long. But I will shoot you. And there we go. Wait, does it set them on fire like it does in Black Ops 1? Yep. Does the same thing. All the stuff that I'm cutting out is just me shooting them mindlessly. That's that's the part that I'm cutting out. So you're not missing much, by the way, when I edit up this challenge. So far, we have four out of 27 weapons on round 17, which isn't really reflective of how well we're doing. Again, we're really going for points. So we can keep this till round 30 if we need to. Okay, we're running pretty low on ammo, and oh my god, I fell. Oh dear god, that's never a good thing. Never a good thing, is it? Okay, all right, all right, we're going Olympia now. We're going Olympia now. Bang, bang, bitch. I'll take you out one by one. Okay, all right, focus. See, I don't need to be in this situation right now. I don't know why I put myself in this situation. All right, I think it's an appropriate time to spin the box. We're gonna get our first box weapon, ladies and gentlemen, because we're pretty low on ammo. And we got the SMR. All right, we got the shittiest gun of all time, but at least we'll get it out of the way first. I'm just gonna sit here and shoot the hellhounds with this SMR and display to all of you how shitty this gun truly is. Just how pathetic that shit is with double tap too i mean wow i don't know how good this gun was in multiplayer but dear god i really hope it was at least decent because in zombies jesus man uh, uh, okay there we go there we go there we go 
Well, I'm gonna go upgrade this piece of shit. Actually, let's see what else we can get. Hopefully an automatic weapon. Hopefully an automatic weapon. Okay, close. Alright, so this becomes the Smiler, which is the antithesis of what it truly is. It is the Frowner, because it does nothing but make people upset. And this becomes the Epic Win, once again. The, the WN, it should be called. Yep, there it is. So, that brings us up to 6 out of 27. If this is anything like Black Ops 1, this should be a 3-round burst. Let's see if that still holds true. Yep, it does. I actually kind of enjoy it, but I don't know. Eh. Hey, look! This is actually going to be effective now. Get it? Oh yeah, look at that reticle. The Smiler. Yeah. Really brings happiness. I am trading both of these weapons out right the fuck now. I am definitely not keeping either of these. Well, I don't know. I might keep the foul, but I'm definitely not keeping this thing. Let's get another thing. Hopefully, fully automatic. Okay, monkeys. Never will complain with monkeys, but not quite what I was looking for. Something automatic and good. Ooh, perfect. Don't frick it. Let's trade this out as well. Sorry, Win. I love you, but... um. I'd rather have the Type 25. What's actually really interesting is that there were only two SMGs on this entire map. The MP5 and the Shikcom, which we haven't gotten yet. Okay, this is getting a little bit difficult. There's no way I can actually <laughs> camp up there without, like, a ray gun or something on solo. I'm out of ammo on my Type 25, by the way, so this is all I've got. Alright, we'll grab it now, and we'll upgrade both of these things, which will bring us to 8 out of 27. The Type 25, I don't even remember what it's called when it's upgraded. That becomes the Strain 25. Okay, and the Glial becomes the Lamentation. Dude, look at that reticle. It's sick. Alright, alright. Off you go. Off you go. Have a good day at school. Was that a Carpenter? Oh god, we need the Carpenter. Insta-kill as well. Insta-kill as well. Okay, alright, we're golden baby. we golden baby. I'm probably gonna keep these as long as I can until they run out of ammo because I want to try to get as many points as I possibly can. Okay. All right. Not sustainable. Not sustainable. Oh, I almost got trapped right there, too. All right. We're going to toss a monkey. Go get him. You know, in hindsight, I think it would have been better to grab stamina up and train, but, like, that's in hindsight, so it's not really helpful. Oh, we're not going to grab the nuke quite yet. Nukes are not our friends. Nukes are our enemy, enemy, enemies. 26,000 points. That's pretty close to epic, so, uh, but I think I'm going to keep this another round. All right. We'll spin the box. Please, something powerful, like a ray gun or a ray gun mark II, which we can't actually have at the same time. Interesting fact, we've got the Emtar, that's pretty cool. Oh yeah, look at that. Uh, uh. Carpenter of the day saved. The carpenter saves the day. Oh no, okay, alright, fall. You know Jesus was a carpenter, right? Crawler, I'm gonna trust you, that you live. Alright buddy, okay, I'm gonna spin the box and please a ray gun of some kind would be awesome. We got the DSR, okay, that works too, so we'll upgrade that. I don't even know what this is called. It's called like the Destructive Survive uh, Dead Specimen Reactor, not even close. And we also got the MTAR, which becomes the... You know what, not even worth reading. How long can Tim survive up here without having to retreat? One debt to society later. Oh god, it's not looking like long. Uh, uh, I, can, I can do it, I can do it. Don't let them bully you around, Tim. Stand up for yourself, I fell. You know what this video needs? Backstreet Boys in the background. Play it, Tim. Oh, yeah. Okay, now stop fucking playing it, so I don't get copyright. Oh, this is good. This is real good. Uh, nuke. You know what I noticed? We get a lot of nukes during these challenges, I feel. More than any other jobs. I don't want your nukes. This is a really good billiards table. Mine's blue instead of green. It's got a lot of blood on it, but it's still pretty cool. Anyways, I'm gonna go up here and trade out this DSR. The DSR is great, but um, I'll shoot it for you, so you know what it shoots like. It's the same exact thing, but I'm not going to keep it very long. Okay! Okay, Boomer! Alright, well, I think I know where the box is headed uh, due to the process of elimination. I think it's going to spawn right over here. Yo, I totally forgot Semtex grenades were a thing. Right over there. Totally forgot. Anyways, let's see what we got. EMPs, no bueno. <gasps> the Barret! I never thought I'd say this, but I'm excited to get the Barret because I still need to upgrade it, so we'll take that. This thing is actually ass. This is like the worst gun in the game, besides the war machine. Ooh, the ray gun. Okay, definitely gonna take that. The ray gun becomes the ray gun, and the Barrett becomes the I don't know, because I've never upgraded the Barrett because I am not special. Can you die? Thank you so much for dying. And this becomes the macro annihilator. Okay, I guess that's a cool name. Get him, ray gun! Woo, 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 woo. Oh, that's risky. That's risky right there, Tim. Don't do that. Okay. 
What should we do? Should we trade out the Barret? I think that's a resounding yes. Yep, we don't even have much ammo. With it. Well, there's a max ammo, so we got all of our ammo back. Yay, we get to use it even more. There's like no ammo in this thing. You see that? That's like not a lot for a sniper upgraded. Wow. So here's the deal. I can't have the Mark II and the Ray Gun at the same exact time. It won't give it to me. So uh, after I go chase down the box again, I'm going to trade out the Ray Gun, even though it's really good and helpful, and try to get the Mark II. So that's what I have to do. Plus, uh, we can't stick with the Ray Gun for the rest of this game. Maybe if I have Mule Kick, but otherwise, I want to try to get others. The War Machine. Wow. I mean, Jesus. At least it's direct impact when you upgrade it, but this thing is just nothing short of fucking awful. And we got the other launcher. I am going to actually grab both of these, upgrade them, and immediately get rid of them because they are both ass. Not good for points, not even good for damage, not even good for ammo. The RPG is like okay, I guess, but fucking... Oh, good God. What does that bring us up to, by the way? We are at 14 out of 27, which means we're just above halfway. And it only gets easier from here. Ooh, the S12. That's one of the two shotguns in this game. Three, actually. Okay, Python, we needed that as well. So we got two powerful weapons. Not great for points, but let's upgrade them and let's try to keep them as long as we can. We probably won't last that long with the ammo. The Cobra. It's always a really cool gun to have. And this becomes the... I don't know. I don't really remember. I wasn't even a huge fan of BO2 back in the day when it was actually out. Only years later did I begin to love this game. And what is it called again? Ooh, the Synthetic Dozen. What's up, bitch? Bam! Yo, this thing isn't great. It's not great. It's three shot, one kill on round 28. Wow, I'm a poet and I didn't even know it. I rhyme all the time. Check this out. Oh my god. Look at that. Oh. Oh. Die, motherfucker. Okay, we're not gonna last up there. What is that, an insta-kill? Ooh, that makes this gun powerful again. Let me, uh, loop around here real quick. Ooh, double points as well. That's really good. It's really good. Insta-kill again. We'll wait a sec. Grab the carpenter, of course. Getting the Mark II, I feel, is going to take a very long time, unless I happen to get it right now because I'm a god and I'm great at Black Ops 2. Not quite. Wow, that didn't make a crawler. Okay, well, you can make it up to me by giving me a Mark II, please. Oh, close, but no cigar. Cap 40, okay, that's one of the guns we need. Not great, but I'll take it. Okay, the M8A1, that is the other gun. I think that's the last assault rifle. So we're gonna upgrade the Cap 40 and not upgrade the M8A1 quite yet. I have to upgrade the Cap 40 because it's just laughably bad on round 28 without something to help it, so yeah, okay. One thing I really appreciate about Black Ops 2 is that there are shitty weapons, weapons that you would never actually use, because that really increases the value of the actually good weapons, you know what I mean? Like the Galil is so much more valuable in this game because of weapons like the Cap 40 and the Barret and all these other shitty weapons. Like in Black Ops 3, I love the balance, I love how you can pretty much use anything, but that's also sort of a curse. If everything's exactly the same, it's like communism, you know? Nothing's better or worse than the next thing, so why even, like, try anything new? Your boy Tim might be fucked here. Oh, I lived. Who sat down and thought, hey, this gun will be a good idea? Who designed the Cap 40 and was like, yeah, let's make a machine pistol that shoots goddamn BBs. It doesn't even penetrate their skin. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna pray for something good. Get out of my hair. Over there. You fucking queer. Oh no! Oh my god! Run! I am totally out of ammo. So, box. Thank you for spawning in that late. Please, 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 please. Please. Oh my god. Executioner, that's one of the ones we needed. Oh yeah, baby. As much as I don't want to grab the nuke, I might have to. I'll give it a second. Okay, we'll just grab the nuke. We'll grab the nuke. Usually I don't do that, but we got to this time. Executioner becomes the Voice of Justice, which is like a shotgun pistol, which is actually very effective. So we'll take that. Definitely the best handgun in this game. And we will... Okay. Um, are you feeling like dying? Double points. Okay. Uh, I was going to upgrade the M8A1, but I guess there's a max ammo here. Throw a monkey. Eh. Don't go in the lava. There we go. All right. That's the last one. So we'll upgrade the M8A1, and that brings us up to... I believe 19 out of 27. Oh look, okay. This gun is useful once again. Look at this reticle side. Oh my god, it's a 
make you a little funny. I'm gonna try to use out these weapons for this next round, and hopefully we'll have this challenge done before round 35. It might be possible, it might not be. I don't actually know. I think we finished the Keynote or Toten version on round 40? Somewhere along those lines, and Shadows of Evil was like mid 30s as well. It's always usually around mid 30s at least. These challenges definitely take quite a bit. And I'm not sure if this executioner is dropping off yet, is it? Can't really t No, not quite yet, but it'll be soon, so we won't keep it for too long. Double points! I see you, baby! I'm gonna grab it. I'm gonna grab it. There we go. Okay. Uh, max ammo. M -m 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 max ammo. Oh god. Oh god. Please don't kill me. Okay. All right, chill. Throw another one. Throw another one. Grab that. Grab that. We'll throw a, throw a third one. This is a pretty action-packed gameplay, ladies and gents. This is not an easy task, even on easy difficulty. I can't even imagine if this was on normal. My god, there's just not a ton of space on town. The lava is really difficult as well. Okay, we got a couple crawlers. That's good news. Now, please, don't die. I gotta go grab some more weapons, all right? I'll be back. I'll be back, I promise. Okay, the hammer, that's one of the two LMGs. We don't have either of them yet, so we'll definitely take that. And what else we got? The 5.7, that's something else I needed. The 5.7 becomes the, I don't even know. A lot of these Black Ops 2 guns, I don't know. So let's, uh, Ultra. Oh, the other one is Ultra and Violet. That's the dual wield version. The hammer becomes the, the, uh, the screwdriver, I don't know. The, uh, sledgehammer. I mean, this training spot is okay, but there are so many lava pits here, so many lava cracks in the ground, and it's so compressed, and it's so difficult. I don't even know if this is the right area to be in, but there really isn't a better one. Die, motherfuckers! No, 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 no! Oh my god, this is getting a little bit too risky. I'm really not comfortable with any of this right now. That's the shitcom. That's one of the guns we need. Take that. Oh! Oh, okay. Ballistic knife, perfect. Okay, we're gonna upgrade this and get rid of it immediately because it's not very effective. The ballistic knife becomes the cross refrigerator. The cross refrigerator, right? Yep. And uh, then the shit comp becomes, I don't know. I'm gonna stop saying that. I'm gonna stop saying, I don't know, because that's just annoying. Uh, there we go. That becomes 23 out of 27, which means we have four more. RPD, baby. Okay, we'll take that. And, um, well, I guess we need to grab something else as well. Oh, thank you for just dying on me. Oh my god. Double blow, double blow. Alright, well, we're gonna upgrade this. That'll bring us up to 24 out of 27, which means we have three left. Did not intend for that to go that way, but it did, and I'm not gonna complain about it. So we have three weapons left. We have the M1216, that shotgun. Uh, we also have the dual-wield 5.7s and the Raygun Mark II. Those are the last three remaining weapons that we need to upgrade. So I'm just gonna... Pour out a bunch of points here, and then hopefully we'll have close to enough by the end of this. We're already out of ammo with the shit com. That's how quickly it runs out. That's crazy. All right, well, insta kill would make things so much better. It'd make my life so much easier. Max ammo is also cool. Double points. Ooh, I want to go grab that, but I don't want to jump right in that horde. Okay, we're gonna loop around here. Loop around. Okay. All right. This is where my expertise and training comes into play. Oh. Don't burn to death. Grab that. And we spray. Okay. We survived that madness. Oh my god. That was scary in every way. So, let's go grab him. We definitely have enough points. Oh my god, we definitely do. Oh, that's it. That's one of them. That's the uh, the shotgun we needed. So we need the Mark II and the Dual Wield 5.7s next. And that'll be the end of it. Six hours later. Well, here's what I'll do. Uh, the box keeps moving back and forth. I've spun it like 400 times already. So... I'm just going to upgrade this, and that'll bring us up to 25 out of 27. And this is called the Mesmerizer. <gasps> yes! Okay! All right! Damn! Uh, let's go upgrade these real quick. I don't know. I just feel like I need to upgrade them so I don't forget or something. I don't want to take a risk of losing it somehow. And that becomes the Ultra and Violet. Yes. Dual wheel. These are actually really underrated. These are actually really good. And now we have about nine grand to try to get this Mark II, so let's get it. This is actually what I would end up doing anyways, spinning for the Mark II on a regular game of town on a high round. Like, this is what I would be doing had I not got the ray gun earlier, so... This is, uh, not too far from, uh... Can I stop getting the fucking RPG? It's like the fifth time in a row. Oh, he died. He just... Oh, she died. Wow. 
I love when they just fucking pass out and never wake up again, and then the round starts, and now I'm screwed because I'm an RPG. If I lose this challenge because of that, I swear to Christ, just give it, give it over. No, I'll take it for now. No, no! Oh my god, I swear to god, I swear to god, if I fucking lose this challenge, oh my god, there are gonna be hands thrown. There are gonna be hands thrown. Okay. Just wait a sec, just wait a sec, wait for these assholes to pass by. I get so angry when I spend so long on these challenges and I just die. Literally, the, I'd rather, I'd rather, no, nah, I'm not gonna say I'd rather lose a leg. But I, oh, it's the worst feeling in the world, wasting all that time. I just want to complete it. I'm literally one gun away. So that's good. I have to spend all of my money regaining my perks. That is an excellent thing. I'm actually going to grab stamina up this time, which is uh, gonna help me with my speed, of course. Uh, we won't have that damage that we did, but, um, better than nothing? I don't know. I can never get these challenges flawless. It's so difficult to go completely flawless for 35 full rounds while trying to do this. It's just really, it's a lot to ask. Oh, so close. Look at that cock tease right there. Can you, like, cooperate, Box? I, I know you hate me, and I know I just, I'm very unlucky, but can you please just grant me this one thing? Just the Raygun Mark II, alright? That's all I want. There we go. We gotta end the round because I got the Executioner. Oh my god, this is just so frustrating. I'm literally one gun away, and it won't give it to me. I've spent well over 100,000 points just spinning the box, and it's just... Oh god, it's so irritating. This is just for points. Like, this thing, I don't even have double tap anymore. There's no hope of getting any damage done with this thing. It's just all points, which is why I need insta-kills. <laughs> Keep begging for insta kills. It's not what this should be coming down to. I've been doing this for fucking 20 minutes straight. <laughs> Just shooting this RPD. I mean, I'm not getting anywhere. No, 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 no. Oh, god damn. Oh, god damn. No, you f fuck off. Fuck off. I gotta drop. I gotta drop. Don't die. Wow, this is cutting it close, Tim. This is cutting it close. If I can just get the Mark II, I will literally kiss my Black Ops 2 disc. I will kiss it in front of. In front of my dog. I will do that if you could just give me the Mark II. Oh my god. Oh, here they come. Here comes the parade. Fuck you! Never take the Mark II for granted, ladies and gentlemen. If you ever get it out of the box and you're like, eh, I don't want it, fucking take it because it's literally impossible. Look, I got the SMR in round 37 without double tap or pack a punch. I wonder how good this thing will be. I think I'd rather slap them. I mean, I guess this is making the video interesting, even though I'm cutting out like 90% of this footage. Right now it's down to the SMR. And I can't even spin the box because it's in that bumfuck corner where I'm gonna get automatically trapped. I'm completely out now. I am totally 100% out of ammo. So, we have a couple of options. Uh, we can either grab the MP5 or very much risk our lives and go into that corner and pretty much automatically die, actually. So, no, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna go grab the MP5 because that's the only, like, reasonable thing we can do right now and just i don't know try our best with this thing you know what i'll even upgrade it i'll upgrade it temporarily so i can have some sort of damage if any all right we'll re-grab that this doesn't count i'm just re-upgrading a gun i already did on the list are you guys the last ones sort of looks like it <gasps> i got Oh my god! I'll kill you with the regular Mark II, and I'll kill the other one with the upgraded Mark II, and that marks 27 out of 27 weapons, ladies and gentlemen. I have been waiting so long for this moment. It's been so long. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for the next episode. I'm going to do this exact sort of video with World of War Darius and a Black Ops 4 map, probably one of the four launch ones because uh, that's sort of what I've been doing, I guess. Um, again, I hope you guys have a phenomenal day. I'm so happy I finally got this done. I did not want this to be a failed attempt. And I hope you guys do good in school and stuff, and Merry Christmas coming up. And I am... I did not forget about that giveaway on that video with Rabbit and I, so I will be announcing that pretty soon. On Christmas Day, probably. Have a great one.